a lot of confusion about how mirrors work. So I'm going to put um, physics education in front of the mirror. And you can, can you see the image inside the mirror, deep inside the mirror? Notice the symmetry that the, the, what you see on the left um, in the object is on the left in the mirror, and what you see on the right on the object is on the right in the mirror. What you see at the top in the object is at the top in the mirror, and, uh, and so on. So it's symmetric uh, in every way. And the confusion comes by looking at three-dimensional objects. So I brought Woof Woof along. I borrowed this from my granddaughter. So Woof Woof is going to look in the mirror. And uh, we can again say that the, they agree between object and image about what up is. They agree about um, what left on, in, in the object and left in the image are, uh, right and right. But what they disagree on is what is front and what is back. The noses both point to the mirror, and the tails both point away from the mirror. And that leads to the problem, because uh, being uh, thinking uh, creatures, we imagine ourselves in the image position. We mentally take ourselves to the image position and say, where is my right hand? And when you do that, when you take yourself inside the mirror um, imaginatively, then we have a disagreement about what is the right and what is the left. So it's, a, it's a, a creation of basically the way that the brain works and being able to imagine looking in there, um, the, the, the symmetry is exact, left is left, right is right. Um, it's just the back to front um, reversal that leads to this other problem when you start to think about it. Contrary to what many people uh, believe, the, the mirrors do not reverse left to right. It, it only reverses front to back.